The Allied Arts Council is kicking off this year's Sculpture Walk and News Press Now's Leah Rainwater is live downtown to give us a preview of tonight's event. Leah? I'm here with Bobby Kronk, who volunteers with Allied Arts. Now, Bobby, can you tell me what we're going to expect to see tonight? How many different sculptures? Mm, yeah, so this is the first night of our sculpture walk. So tonight we're recognizing all of the sponsors and welcoming the artists into town who have brought their pieces to our community. There are 15 new pieces of art um, around downtown St. Joseph. So um, they come from all over the Midwest and even, you know, parts of Texas and, and you know, far, they, they've come from far and wide to bring their art to our community. Alrighty, and um, how do you think that this impacts the community? Uh, well, art is really, it, it transcends, you know, it allows us to see things through different perspectives, allows us to experience emotions and have shared, ex, you know, shared experiences. And this public art is wonderful because it truly removes barriers and allows everyone to experience together and creates the kind of vibrant community that we want to live in. Um, and we're also so fortunate that we're able to purchase a piece every year and we donate it back to the city of St. Joseph. So some one of these pieces will stay with us um, forever. So as the years go on, as we do more of these sculpture walks, um, we'll have more and more art um, in our downtown St. Joseph. Wonderful. Well, I have seen some beautiful pieces so far. Thank you so much, and I can't wait to participate on the walk. We will see you back here at 6 on CBS and NBC. I'm Leah Rainwater reporting live for News Press Now. Back to you.